Lucky 1000 and today I got a parcel a couple of days ago. In fact, we were away. So, um, I haven't opened it up yet because I wanted to do a review on it. So, here it is. We're going to move you over so you can see it. And there it is. So, we're going to open this up and we'll see what it is. Now, I'm going to bring you back over here so you can see. Okay. is a new camping pad. I bought this for me um, because, you know, the ground is hard. I'm getting older and I really need it to support my neck. Um, so I thought I'd get this and see if I like it and maybe it will help. Um, because when you're flat on the ground, you're even if you have a pillow, you're still pretty flat. So this has a pillow in it, and I guess these are patches, if it, it gets in, and then you've got your little baggie here, which is cute, and then I have your user manual here, so that's cool, it is blue, it does have a pillow attached to it, now I'm going to use a regular pillow on top of that pillow to prop up my neck because of the injury from the accident. So, and I need to have something. Ensure the ground area is clear and free of objects. Lay the sleeping pad out flat on the ground. Before inflating, ensure that the deflation valve on the pillow is closed tightly. Open in inflation valve on the front pump and inflate with your foot. Do not over inflate. Quick foot. The pump can be fully inflated in 30 seconds. Close the inflation valve. So we're going to do this. I'm going to do it in the living room right here so we can see how it works. So stay tuned. I'm stretching it out. Bruno's going to check it out. I'm going to um, put Bruno in the other room. Just hold on just a second so he doesn't crawl on this. Come on, Bruno. Come on. In here. Yes. There you go. I'll let you out in just a second. All right. So hopefully I'm going to bring you down a little bit more so you can see. Uh, hopefully you can see that pad. There you go. So, here we are. Uh, I don't know. I guess this is the... There we go. Let me get the directions here. That's pretty good. Pretty long, I think. Um, yeah. I think it's pretty long. See how long it is? I'm going to back you up a little bit so you can see kind of how long it is. Yeah, that's a good size. And it's got a little pillow on it. So... Okay. Before inflating, ensure that deflation valve on the pillow is closed tightly. So let's see where that is. This is the pillow up here. So we have to make sure this is closed tightly. I guess you poke it in. You hear? Uh, we've got the lawnmower going. He's going to cut grass today. Had to work on it a little bit, so there we go. So we got that. It's a nice little pillow. Got a little tiny pillow. It's squishy. Okay, so you got to inflate it, but it doesn't give you a, a thing to to do that. Or okay, open inflation valve on the foot pump. What foot pump? Probably have to buy your own foot pump. That's probably what it 
maybe it was built in or something? Nope. Nothing here. So I guess you have to have your own little foot pump. And it didn't come with it. So anyways, I'm going to see how to, how we can pump this up. I'll be right back. Okay, guys, we figured this out. Shaver had to come in and show me. This little squishy thing, I thought it was the pillow. But it's not. This right here is the built-in pump. That end down there is the pillow. So I'm going to sit here and pump it up. And it did say make sure you had the pillow closed. So I got that closed. And I guess you keep this one in. And you kind of just pump it up. That's a lot of arm work there. And it's kind of hurting my neck a little bit. So I don't know if I'll be able to do all this. I might have to get him to help me. So we'll sit here for a moment. And you can watch it pump. He, he broke one of my trees and come in. I oh, think I might have done something. That's ah, just a little tree. It's no big deal. It needed to be tidied up anyways. So I don't know why. I guess this is because you put the air in it. So let's see. You put your foot on here. Let's straighten this out again, since we know what we're kind of doing. So all I did really, it, it, it gives you a little bit in, dire in direction. So I was like, well, she's got her foot on this. But I thought this was awful squishy, so I thought this was really the pillow. But it's not. This is the pillow up here. So we're going to try to pump this up. Hopefully you can see. And watch me pump this sucker up. That's 
that's okay. You're not probably going to do that. I'd probably put something underneath it in the tent anyways, like a blanket or something, so I don't slide. Oh, well, this is not bad. Okay. Now, I'm going to also use a regular pillow on top of this. Yeah. Ooh, I got down here, got dirty. I'm still not my best. I'm still out of work. So. And, yeah. Oh, it feels good. Yeah, it's nice. I like it. Not too bad. snap these domes together. That's probably what you do. Okay. Yeah. Well, that's kind of nice. Now that I know how to use it. That's pretty cool. I'll just snap these together. Tiny again. That'll be nice for packing. I mean, we're car camping. We're not. We're not doing any hiking or anything like that. But if I wanted to take it to the beach or something, you know, I could probably take it down to the beach and lay on it. If I 
Maybe you roll it the other way so it doesn't get so puffy. Sorry. Let me move you up a little bit. There you go. I'm going to move you back over to the chair so we can sit here for a few minutes. Up. Whoa. And there we go. Yeah. So I'm going to put it in the bag. I probably could have got more air out of it still. Um, hopefully you can hear me. He's he's got he's on a mission for cutting the grass today, so so that's a good thing because the grass has gotten very high. We had a lot of rain and we couldn't cut the grass. And now it's dried out, so and he had to fix the tires on my lawnmower so he could. Uh, Cut the grass. So he did that. Now he's cut the grass. So, yeah, you just have to play with this a little bit better. Um, I'll get better at it as I go because I'm going to be able to put it in here pretty good. But I think you just play with it. So it does have a pump on it. So that squishy thing that you, I thought that was a pillow is the pump. So the other end is the pillow. Cool. I don't know if it's going to go in here. Still got too much air in it, I think. did it the other end, like maybe rolled it from the pump first, then maybe I wouldn't have had so much air in it. I don't know. So we'll have to play with it a little bit and see. It is comfortable though. That is, I can say, and this is tile, so I figured if I can lay on this tile, I can lay on the, in the tent on this, so I think it'll be just fine. And I will give you an update on it, and we'll get Shea Bear to lay on it so he can, uh, you know, when we're tenting or something, he can try it out and see if he wants. He wants one, I think, because his hips were hurting him this time when we went. So, um, yeah, well, you know, he was on a rock, so that didn't help any. So we tried to move, but it wasn't working too good, I don't think. Anyways, oh, I'm trying to get this in here. It's fighting me a little bit. Yeah, because it deflated everywhere else except down where the pump is. So I'm thinking maybe I rolled it from the pump first. And then from the other. I got my directions over there. I'll, I'll look at them a little bit more. But they're more of a picture. They don't really explain too, too much, I don't think. But especially if you're new and you've never done it before, you know. I mean, I mean people who have done this, you know, before, it took them no time. They probably already have it in the bag. But, you know, I've never, never had one. Because we, 
We camped when I was a kid. We had a trailer and we camped that way, so we never really tented. I tented a bit when I was married, but we always slept on the ground, and we really didn't do a whole lot of it. Just when we wanted to go to the mountains once in a while. So, we were always working, or we did BMXing back then, so we were busy doing that. And a lot of those BMXing places, you have to get a hotel because they're in the city and they won't let you camp at their parks. So that was kind of a bummer because I think if you could have camped, you know, it would have saved us money and the kids would have had more fun, I think, than going to a motel. You know, hotels can be very expensive, especially in the city. So anyways, I'm getting there. I'm not getting it all in there because it still has air in it, so I'll probably have to redo it. And that's probably what I'm going to do. Yep. I'm going to have to redo it. So we'll try it the other way and see if I can get more air out of this first. And there. Jeez. This is like work. Yeah, maybe you got to do it this way first. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to do it from the pump first and uh, try it that way. I'm determined to get this done though. So, yeah, this might work better. I should have done it this way, I guess, first. Yeah, because it's taking it out. I think. I think so. Just trying to get in the bag. It's a good size. I like the, how long it is, you know. My feet ain't going to be touching, you know, the ground or anything. Um, I can lay on my side pretty good. That'll be nice. And, uh, yeah. I wish I would have had it when we left. I got it the next day. Yeah, so... I think this is a little bit better. So I would try from the pump and then roll it from there. That's what I would do. Yeah, this is going to be a lot easier. There we go. See how easy that was? And yeah, that's the way to do it, guys. So, anyways, here we go. And you pull the tab here, bring it over. So it's gets covered pretty good. Yeah, that was pretty easy. I made it more harder than it had to be, so. But there you go. And there it is in the thing. So that was easy. It also came with a little thank you card. <laughs> and you are our special guest, it says on the other side. <laughs> That's cool. And again, you want to earn $20 gift. For your next Amazon purchase, only two steps. Leave us five stars, photo review, and send a screenshot to rebate gift card at wapitmail.com. You will receive a $20 gift card when the review is confirmed. Enjoy your shopping with us. So, I'll send them this video and see what they say. Yes. Um, I think the directions, hold on, I'll show you the directions again. I think the directions could have been a little bit bigger, maybe. Um, you know, for people who can't see real well, um, like me. You know, I mean, this is what it, it gave you right here. You can freeze it. Um, it does say, you know, I mean, the pictures could have been a little bit bigger. So I could have seen it. And it does show you right here the inflation, how to do it. So, and it also has clean and care on here. 
You're going to wipe clean only the damp with a damp cloth. Do not use strong detergents. Ensure the pad is completely deflated and dry before storage. Store in a cool, dry place. Keep sharp objects, objects away from the sleeping pad, of course. Extra tips. Please lie down and use it in full comfort. Seated use will affect the user experience because the pressure is not disturbed, distributed. So it's for laying on, not to use as a, as sitting up on it. But the thing is, you're gonna sit, you're gonna sit up on it. You know, you're gonna sit up to take a drink or whatever in the middle of the night or something. But it's mostly just lay on it and, and go to sleep. But I like it. I really, I think this is gonna work really well. Um, I just, you know, the directions are okay. I mean. It's probably more me than it is the, than anything. I think the pictures could have been just a little bit bigger. So, you know, people that have trouble seeing, they can see these pictures. But that's probably because, you know, they're trying to save money, you know, any way they can. So, and they give you patches right here. So, that's good to have, you know. So, yeah, I like it. I hope you enjoyed the video. I'm sorry I got a little messed up there with the air thing because I was like, where's the pump? I was looking for a little pump and then you put it in and pump it with your foot. That's what I was looking for. But if the pictures were a little bit bigger, I probably would have seen it and I wouldn't have had that problem. So, you know, so anyways, that's the only thing I have a complaint on. But Shea Bear came in and showed me. He's had them before, so, and I've never had them, so, for someone who has never had them, you know, you want to have good instructions so they can do it. It's really not that hard, of course, nothing is once you learn it. So, anyways, Monkey says she's out for now. I'm gonna